So give me some fin. Noggin. Dude. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel. This is my first video with my new name, Minimum Player Count. This is also my first Kickstarter preview game. This game is called Open Oceans. It is a game that has been designed and illustrated by Joel Bodkin. This is a prototype version, so all components are subject to change. In this preview, I will be explaining how to play in a two-player version. This is a set collection and card drafting game. In Open Oceans, it is your goal as a marine biologist to rebuild the ocean that was destroyed by a massive typhoon and create the highest scoring combination of colorful creatures. This video will be broken down into sections. The timestamp will be below in the description in case you want to jump to a certain part of this video. Choose one of six starting coral and decide on who the first and second player will be. Last person to see a fish, dead or alive, is the first player. Deal seven cards to each player and eight cards into the ocean. The rest of the cards, excluding the starting cards, will be placed into the ocean. Cards are broken down into categories of small fish, medium fish, big fish, and special cards. It is important to note the type of fish you will attract by looking at the bottom right of the card. Coral will attract small fish, small fish will attract medium fish, medium fish will attract big fish. Players will pick a card from their hand, placing it upside down. Starting with the first player, you reveal your card and place in your reef, following the action that is on that card, attracting fish from the ocean. In this case, small fish will attract larger fish, medium fish. So that will go in your reef. You replenish the ocean and then the second player will go revealing their card and placing it and attracting fish. And then refilling the ocean. The second player then has the option to discard a card from the ocean and then refill the ocean. Players then take their cards and their player token and pass it on to the other player. Continuing again from the first step is picking a card and placing it upside down. Special cards like this dolphin card have special actions that you can do from the cards. In this case, this dolphin card, you can take this card and exchange another card in another person's reef and place it into your own reef and then take that action. So in this case, small fish attracting medium fish. The next special action card is the shark. The shark card, you get to take any fish from the ocean and place it into your reef. So I would say take this card and take the action from it of medium fish. Refresh the ocean. And the turtle card is to completely refresh the ocean. taking any card from that new refill and taking the action. Some important things to note about building your reef is reef cards that have the sun on them must be connected to another sun card. The order in which fish can be played is sun, one, two, and three. You can also school fish, which are having fish of the same type. These fish must be connected by a border and do not count if they are connected diagonally. So in this case, these fish would count as a school, but these two would not. Schooling fish gets you extra points. Open Ocean is a light strategic game that features beautiful artwork and a quick gameplay. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe to see more videos like this. See you guys next time. Dude. You rock, dude! Ow. Curl away, my son!